Frauenbach was born in 1929 in a rural little town um, in the north of Germany. Um, and his biography is quite average. And he bought this house here in 67. And he worked his whole life in odd jobs. The big column in the living room is, has a little bit basement even. So, and it's going through the whole room and even into the attic. So it's basically like a pillar through the whole house. He did work a lot with found objects and pieces which are considered sometimes as disturbing. Uh, they are done very in, in a quick manner, not cast of clay studies, but really over layered uh, found objects, pieces, stuffed animals, um, dolls, stuff like that. In the kitchen we found that he did not cook anymore. He basically went to the coffee time or other franchise cheap uh, places where you can get um, soup and muffins and we found a lot of expired uh, food. Sketching was for him like writing a diary, but he did not always go back to it. There are sketches of constructive work he never, uh, he never did, uh, in fact, and there, most of the work is with, without any sketches, there's no relation. But the themes, of course, are going through the sketches and the sculptural work. Positioned in this little, little space, the art pieces as if it, would, if it would be a gallery room. So he basically uh, shows us there that he has had a consciousness about, his, uh, about himself being an artist. have lived with a female companion, but probably never were lovers, because the bed is just not wide enough. But also it could be that she just appeared once or twice a week and he installed this whole room for her.